Hello, everyone. My name is Shirley, and I am the owner of Shirley's Daughters. Um, Shirley's Daughters is a company I started about five years ago to help raise extra funds for me and my girls. Hence the name Shirley's Daughters. Okay, the company was named for my daughters. Shirley's Daughters is a company that is here to help women with their skincare concerns. Because I feel like all women should look and feel good. Well, tonight I am here because I want to talk to you about some ways to slow down the clock on that, that aging skin. So we're going to talk anti-aging tonight. There are three factors that you want to consider when you're talking about your skin and anti-aging. The first one's going to be sunscreen. The second one is going to be boosting the collagen in your skin. And the third one is going to be antioxidants. So let's talk about sunscreen. Sunscreen is something that everyone should have. And I mean everyone. 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 I mean everyone needs sunscreen. And the reason that I say that is because 80 to 90% of the damage that is done to your skin, those, those effects of aging per se, are caused by the UV rays of the sun. So when you go outside... Um, it's best to have some sunglasses and a big old floppy hat to cover yourself up. And you need some sunscreen. A sunscreen with an SPF of 30 or better is going to protect you. About 97% 90 of the sun's rays if you get a sunscreen that's um, SPF 30 or better. There isn't anything out there that is 100% that's going to block the UV rays. So, like I said, it's important, everyone. Um, sunscreen is also going to slow down um, or lessen, let's say, lessen the chance of cancer as well because the UV rays are also cause skin cancer. So, it's going to slow down the aging process and lessen the chance of skin cancer if you use an SPF. Number two, boosting the collagen in your skin. Okay, so the word collagen is a Greek word meaning glue. And so really, honestly, collagen is the glue that holds our body together. So you have collagen in your joints and in your skin. And as you get older, your body doesn't produce as much collagen. And then that's when you start to see the fine lines like I got here that I'm working on. And the wrinkles and the sagging skin. That's from losing your collagen. So here are some ways to boost that. Applying vitamin C serum to your skin is going to help boost your collagen production. You want to make sure you get these areas underneath the eyes because that's a very sensitive area. Your skin is very thin there. Sometimes people miss that just by not paying attention to, you know, exactly where they're putting whatever it is they're putting on their face. Um, so vitamin C is a good way to boost collagen production. Changing your diet is another way to boost collagen production. So you want to get your fruits and vegetables like broccoli is a really good one. And there's also corella and spirulina. And those are two algaes that you can add to your food, to your smoothies or whatever you're making. And they help your body produce more collagen. Two things I'd never heard of before I started researching about anti-aging. But those are two, of, two good sources of collagen for you. Um, and let's see, we did sunscreen, your diet. Um, oh, and there's something called micro-needling. Micro-needling is something that supposedly can be done at home, but I really recommend that you have a professional do it. And basically what it is, is 
they use some type of instrument to put small holes in your skin and your skin reacts it starts the healing process so basically what you're doing is this is a way of exfoliating so putting the holes in your skin it starts the healing process the healing process a byproduct of that is collagen so it's a way of tricking your body into producing more collagen but like i said i would have it done by a professional they say there are some ways to do it at home but i'm just one of those people where i'm not gonna mess with that because it's my face i only have one <laughs> so those are three ways to boost the collagen in your skin to keep you with that glow okay and the last thing we want to talk about is antioxidants Antioxidants are very good for your body, period, but they're really good for your skin. One we've already talked about, which is vitamin C, is going to be really good for you to, I can't say it enough, to get you a good vitamin C serum that's going to make your skin glow and it's going to help produce that collagen, which is going to make your skin feel plump and tight. Um, so that's one thing you want to do for antioxidants. Now, as far as um, antioxidants that you can eat, what I recommend are um, green tea. Green tea is very high in antioxidants, so it's very good for your skin. And also organic berries are very high in antioxidants. And so, um, and another thing with the berries is they have something called hyaluronic acid in them as well. And the hyaluronic acid helps your skin to retain moisture. So eating berries is going to give you a double punch. You're going to get um, collagen production and you're going to get um, your skin is going to hold the moisture better. So me, myself, I eat a lot of strawberries and I eat a lot of blueberries. Those are my berries of choice. And both of them are high in antioxidants and vitamin C. Okay, and um, the other thing that you can use, there are some topical things that you can use that are antioxidants that are good for your skin. That would be, um, I always can never pronounce it every time I get ready to see it, um, but it's the antioxidant that is found in wine, and I, I can't say it now, Um it, it's, it, you find it in grapes, so it's in wine. It's very high in antioxidants, so it's very good for your skin. That's why you hear people say um, drinking a glass of wine every day is good for you because this antioxidant is in it. I, every time I can't say it. Okay, so you've got that one. And then you've got retinol, which is a basically vitamin A. Um, so vitamin A is really good for your skin. So when you see products with retinol in them, that's really good. Sometimes doctors prescribe a type of retinol. So that would be good. So you've got vitamin A. You've got the antioxidants in berries. And you've got the antioxidants that is in wine and grapes okay so that is really everything that i had to cover for boosting well really for um anti-aging on your skin you want to make sure you have a good spf which is 30 or more you want to be covered up when you go out in the sun sunglasses and a hat um to boost your collagen you can do that with your diet Eating things like broccoli and adding like um, that algae that I talked about to your diet, spirulina and corolla. Or you can use some topical things to antioxidants that will also help, which is the retina, the retinol and the um, vitamin C. So that is what I have for you tonight. I um want to thank you all for taking the time to stop by and listen um if anyone has any questions yes i did say wine is good for your skin it has an antioxidant in it that um 
is very good for the skin. I'm not saying go out and drink a whole bottle every day. <laughs> but a glass of wine every now and then is going to be good for you. Yes. Let's see, were there any other questions here? Okay, that looks like that was it. Um, if you think of anything else that you'd like to ask, you can just hit me up in the DM. I'll be glad to um, talk to you about anti-aging. Um, there is one other thing, though. I just wanted to um, let you all know if you're, you'll take two glasses. Okay. <laughs> I am mad at you. I'm not mad at you. Um, I just wanted to let you all know that I have put together a package of products that I recommend that you use for anti-aging. And um, so if you want more information on that, go over to my profile and click the link and then go to Collagen Booster and you'll find the information on those products that I'm talking about. Well, if there aren't any more questions, I'm going to say... Make sure you follow me here on IG. I am also on Facebook. Uh, my business page is Shirley's Daughters, your Avon connection in the metro Detroit area. That's the name of my page. Um, and um, you can also find me on YouTube under Shirley's Daughters. I am also on Twitter under Shirley's Daughters. So we can communicate however you'd like to communicate. So that would be all that I have for you tonight. Thanks for listening, and we will talk to you later. Bye-bye.